But rivalries kind of, they, they take life, I guess, when you have a playoff series against a team. Does it feel like there's a little more on, on these matchups against teams like the Bruins this year? Uh, 100%. I mean, anytime you play someone in the playoffs and uh, you develop a bit of a hatred for the team and definitely a rivalry. And uh, it was a bunch of good games last year in the playoffs. And uh, I'm excited to get some emotion in the game. Uh, and have fun in uh, their building. Do you think, in a sense, it's going to feel like things are heightened really every game in the Atlantic Division this year? I mean, it's uh, no secret. It's maybe the most competitive division in the league. Yeah, I think every every game means something. And, I mean, uh, anytime you play with a division opponent, it's huge for the to get into the playoffs for sure. And every game matters. And uh, there's no off nights in the NHL. I mean, everyone comes to play every night. And, I mean, uh, we can't take anyone lightly. But, obviously, the Bruins are... Uh, one of the best teams in the league, and it's going to be a good challenge. That was a heck of a moment for you last time you were there. Do you think you're going to feel anything when you step back on the ice and remnants of that? Yeah, I think it'll be pretty cool. I mean, it's always fun playing in that building. They have uh, some pretty crazy fans. The building gets pretty loud, and I mean, yeah, definitely, definitely good memories in that building from last year. And, uh, it could have gone either way, but uh, it's going to be fun. Yeah, I see them around the rink every. Every day, and they're working hard. They want to get back, and I'm sure it, uh, it's uh, killing them to get back on the ice and hang around the guys. And I mean, uh, it was a long recovery for them, and uh, it's always nice seeing them. They looked awesome today, and I think uh, they'll be ready to go soon, hopefully. And on that, not back in the lineup yet, but now they're back on the trip, they're back in the locker room. Does that mean something to kind of get them back in the bubble with you guys? Oh, 100%. I think it's definitely big for even for their mental mindset to. Uh, even get around the guys, feel part of the team. I mean, sometimes I think when you're injured and not around the team that much, uh, you kind of lose it a little bit. And I mean, yeah, bringing them on the road will be fun. And, yeah. Is it fun to be a part of this rivalry now? I mean, it seems like there's a whole Miami Boston thing going right now, and you guys are right in the thick of it. With yeah. The yeah. Even the Marlins. Yeah, I mean, any kind of rivalry is fun. It's uh, always fun playing meaningful games, and when things get competitive, that's when. That's what you play for, kind of, when it gets really competitive in the playoffs. And I mean, uh, when there's a lot of emotion involved, uh, I think that makes the most fun games. And that's kind of as what we were players, what we play for. So it's and a it, lot of fun. And it does take that, right? It had to be a playoff series. It couldn't just be a, you know, a regular season game that you guys yeah. maybe had some fist, you know, to make a rivalry. It's got to be the playoffs that really get it heated. Yeah, 100%. Anytime you go. Head to head against the same team, seven games in a row. It's going to be pretty heated, and things are going to get intense, and going to develop some dislike for the other team. And I mean, yeah, it's definitely uh, levels up the intensity for sure. Thanks, Carter. Thanks, guys.